Hello, my Furan friends. It's so nice for me to be able to be with you here at this celebration, if we can call it that. For those who don't know who I am, my name is Margaret Connor. I taught for the English department in the mid to late 90s. And then through the power of the internet, I was an online teacher there um, for the graduate program and for undergraduates through 2008, I think, or even 2009. I'm not exactly sure when. Um, and when Julie reached out to me and asked me to say a few words about the Media Center, I was quite pleased because Furana was a very special place. It was my favorite place that I ever worked and I ever taught, and I miss it dearly to this day, and I think about it often. And the Media Center played a very large role in my teaching. I love media, I love film, I love theater, I teach them, and through the Media Center, I was able to share that love with my students, with the materials that I could get from the Media Center. Uh, when I was living in Taiwan, it was an excellent resource for me when I was homesick or when I just needed a little bit of New York. The people who worked there were always incredibly friendly and incredibly kind and incredibly helpful. They helped my students use the classrooms to watch assigned films to work on their English. They went out of their way to get the materials that I needed, even if the school didn't have them. And they were just wonderful people to work with. And I was very sad to leave. When I was able to come back, thanks to Kate, um, it was through the media center that my classes were held because I would be living in actually Sweden and I would get up really early in the morning and have classes and my students would sit in the media center and we would have lectures and that was such a wonderful thing to be back at Furen. So it really helped make a really lovely experience and an important experience of mine possible. And when she first reached out to me, Julie asked me to speak for about five minutes, and I'd love to, but I don't think I can talk that long. Um, first of all, because it was a while ago, and I don't remember a lot, but also my voice is going. I think you can hear it. It's that season. It's the last week of classes here in, a, in America where I'm teaching now. Um, but... I miss Furen very much, and change is good, and change is so important, and I'm glad for change, but it also can be sad, and it's a little sad for me because Furen holds such an important part in my heart that I hate to think of it changing, even though I know that it's going to be a better and stronger school, and it looks very different. I haven't been there since 2006. Um, so I know things are very different from when I was there in the 90s, and they've even changed more now. I worked with somebody in the Middle East who had worked at Furen, and told, he told me about the changes that had happened in the teens. Well, I guess the 10s and the 11s and the 12s. What do we call those years? But thank you for listening to me. Those of you that I worked with back then, I miss you so much. Um, you're great colleagues. And the Media Center was a wonderful resource and just made being a teacher much, much easier, especially for me. So thank you very much and Happy New Year when it comes.